Hi crafters, it's Karen, and I have a little collective online haul to share with you. I, I did this video yesterday and uploaded it, and then um, realized that I was just flashing my address all over the place. <laughs> so um, I deleted that video, and I'm going to redo it. So if this looks like a repeat, it's because it is. <laughs> so um, the first um, thing I wanted to share with you is this um, haul from Crafters Companion. And a little, a little bit ago, Tina Kappa here on YouTube had given us the heads up that the Spectrum Noir uh, marker storage was on sale for 40% off for 12 hours only. And it was only this style. And um, so I jumped on that real quick. Thank you so much, Tina, for posting that video because I've been looking for something to keep my spectrums in. So anyway, this storage system holds um, 72 markers and I think there's one, well, here it is. This is it. It holds 72 markers and there's one, two, three, four, five, six trays. So this was on sale for 40% off. Normally it's $24.95, but um, the discount was $10. But plus the shipping, it came to $21.92, which is not bad because this will fit all my spectrums and it was cheaper than, um, it, you know, it was a lot cheaper. So thank you so much, for Tina, for bringing this to our attention. So that's the first thing. The next haul is from joannes.com and I wanted to share this because, you know, I'm not sure if you guys realize um, that they carry all kinds of Prima junkyard findings at prima.com. So a little while back they had the, um, the free shipping with a $25 minimum purchase um, coupon code which worked out great for me because that's about the price I had in my cart anyway. So um, I'm going to share this order. I picked up a lot of Prima Junkyard Findings. And the first thing I got was these vintage trinkets. And these are the little zipper pulls. And they're really sweet. These are a lot bigger than what they look like online. Um, and they all say something different. This one says Priceless, um, Explore, Create. So these are really cool. And these were all on sale. So this was $3. I think it, they were all 50% off. So this was $3. Then I picked up this Prima Resin. And this is the um, clock set. There's the stopwatch, the clock, and then the clock post. And this was $2.50. And these are a lot bigger than what I thought they would be, which is a nice surprise. See that? So I picked that up. I think these are still, all this stuff is still on sale, and I think it's all half off. The next thing I picked up was um, the Junkyard Findings water taps, and these are awesome too, but these are a lot smaller than I thought they'd be. And um, these were $3 as well, and the little faucets say different things. It says time, luck, bliss, and... Um, really cute and I picked up all these things because I'm really wanting to do some altered layouts or mixed media canvases and stuff so um, that's why I went looking for these and I picked up another set of these primer resins these this is the uh, topiary set and these are a lot bigger than what I thought they'd be too so that was a welcome surprise um, this was 250 and then I picked up these um, heart gears, and these are awesome. These are a lot bigger than what I thought. They, a lot bigger than what I thought they would be. These are so sweet. These are the um, heart gears, and they're just feminine gears. They're so cute. Um, I think these were two seventy nine. I think, and there's three, six, nine pieces in each. And they're just feminine gears in the white. Really sweet. So I picked up, oh wait, these were $3. Anyway, I picked up two packs of these because I knew I would go through them. They're awesome. 
And then the last thing I got was these Junkyard Findings Vintage Tub Knobs. And look, these are really cute. These are smaller than I thought they'd be, but still they're a really good size. Um, they say joy, love, care. So these would look really cute on an altered canvas or a mixed media layout of maybe Alyssa during tub time or I don't know, something, something cute. So I picked those up and then to round out my $25, I picked up the Julie Nutting Buff Paper Pad in, in the A4. And this was, um, this is specifically for the Prima Dolls, you know, for the different skin tones for the Prima Dolls. So um, if you are a subscriber of mine, you know how much I enjoy playing with the Prima Dolls. So um, the, they all have script or some type of text on them, and the colors are just beautiful. Just beautiful. So um, I picked this up, and this was only $5. It was 50% off. So altogether, my order came to like $27, which is great. You know, I got the paper pad and three, five packs of the Junkyard Findings and two packs of the Prima Resins. So I thought that was a great deal. Um, and then... I believe it was Tina Kappa also last week who, um, who gave us a head, heads up on the CC Designs um, clearance sale. They had put a whole bunch of stamps up on sale. And when I say sale, I mean $1.50, $2.50, $2.75, really great prices. So I picked up four stamps. Um, I sent one of my stamps away already, but... Um, but these are the stamps that I chose, and including shipping, my whole bill came to uh, $10.49. So the first one I got was this Druzy stamp by, um, yeah, Druzy. It's called Watermelon Girl. I just thought she was really sweet. I love the little wings on these girls. Really sweet. So I picked her up, and then I picked up this one, Snow Flurry Emmeline. And she's really cute, really sweet, and she's really tiny. But I like the fact that she's already cut out because this one, I'm going to have to cut this one out, and I never do a good job. It's always tricky. <laughs> so, um, And then I picked up this one. I'm not sure if this was a um, Sweet November stamp or not. It doesn't have the label, but it was really super cute if you can make that out. And I'm going to have to trim her out a little bit, too. But um, she was really sweet. So that was one CC Designs haul. And then um, the other day, or last week, actually, um, Bona, she is Live Love Scrap, had done a video. She had created some projects for Valentine's Day. Um, really super cute um, things. Anyway, she was using this stamp by Little Blue Buttons. And I love Little Blue Buttons. And... Um, I had to pick the stamp up. <laughs> so I was watching her video, and then I went right over to CC Designs and picked, picked the stamp up. It's the Ragdoll Sweetheart Love Letter. And isn't she sweet? She's standing there holding her letter, dear to her heart. The little bird is singing. It's really cute. I know this stamp also comes in a digital, um, digitally. You could purchase it digitally. Um, which is nice because then you can print her out any size that you want. So I think I'm going to do that. But uh, I thought she was really cute. And that's what she looks like. I love these ragdoll stamps. So yeah, I saw Bona's video, saw the project she made, and had to get the stamp. <laughs> and while I was at CC Designs, I noticed that they had restocked their Wink of Stella pens. So I was super excited because I wanted to get the clear one. So I don't know which is which, but I picked up the clear Wink of Stella and the white Wink of Stella. And I would have picked up more, but these pens are expensive. I think they're like six bucks or something crazy. Yeah, they're six dollars. No, six forty nine. These pens are six forty nine. But um, I'm going to try them out. I'm excited to try them. They look like makeup um, pens or something, don't they? I thought. <laughs> anyway, I'm excited to try these. They had all different colors, but 
I chose the clear and the white. So, um, oh, and also, I guess it was over the weekend when Michaels had gotten their, when I heard that Michaels had gotten all the new Heidi Swap stuff in, I wanted to go over there and check out the sprays, the color shines. So I just picked up three of them, and uh, I picked up the blush. This is a gorgeous vintage pink color. I mean, really beautiful. And then I picked up the sea foam, and this is a beautiful vintage greenish color. I just love this. So I'm excited about these colors. And then I picked up the navy, <clears throat> only because it's so pretty. And um, I do a lot of pages with my sons and my husband, so um, I thought this would come in handy. And um, they also have a coral color that I'd like to pick up, but um, I don't know. These things are getting picked through so quickly at, at Michael's. And then, um, and then I picked up this Heidi Swap stamp, and it's all one. It, this is all one piece. This is all one one background stamp. Really cool. I think I don't have a an acrylic block large enough for this, but I'm going to use my um, Big Kick acrylic plates, you know, as my acrylic block. You know what I mean? To, so that I can use the stamp. It's really cute. This would make a great background for a um, card or a tag. Just awesome. So that is my little haul. And um, thanks so much for watching, and I'm sure I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.